Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, me and Lee are heading to Woodchester Mansion in Gloucestershire. Now, if you don't know what that is, it's a um, unfinished mansion. Is you know currently an ongoing project. Um, it's open to the public. You can walk around the grounds, go inside, take photographs. Obviously, so yeah, it's interesting. I've been once before, but that was actually for a medium ship with a mate that actually lives on the grounds of the Woodchester Mansion, which is incredible. And uh, yeah, it should be a good day. We're gonna go take some photos, vlog it. And at the end of it, we're going to go to the ramming because that's only just down the road. And I know you can't go in there now, but it'll be good to see the out outside because it's such an iconic place. So, yeah, I'll see you in Lee's car in a bit. So, folks, we have just arrived near the Woodchester mansion. We are about a mile's walk away. We could have caught the bus, but we want to see the lovely nature and park around the Woodchester mansion. So, so we just got to the Woodchester mansion and uh, yeah, we're about to go inside. Stunning place. So guys, we just got into Woodchester mansion and it is stunning. I gave some more shots in a bit guys. Guys, look at the roof. This place is absolutely stunning. So guys, we're currently in the East Corridor and uh, yeah, I'll just do a pan of the history for you so you can pause it and read it instead of me reading it out and sounding like an idiot with my terrible reading skills. So guys, I found Lee in the scullery. scullery, and like I said, I don't read, so here's the history for you. Pause it if you want, if I went fast, uh, if I went slow enough. Uh, that you've got a kitchen as well with some stunning windows. A lovely fireplace. Hey Lee. Yeah. Jordan would like this place. Where's that? They serve alcohol. You never get around yet.
Right, so we're going to the Organ Loft Gallery and uh, we're going up some spiral staircases. Lee's already up in front there in a ghost on route. Why? Maybe. Oh, you can see out the windows as well. Maybe, no. It's cool. Here we go. Wow. I can't wait for this to be done properly. And then over there then you've got the remnants of a stained glass window. A stained glass window, guys. Wow, if it was stained glass. I can't see any pigment in there. But yeah. The old girl starting to look this out. Right then guys, so it's upstairs time and I shall follow Lee. This place is stunning guys. The windows, everything about it, the, the lighting in here is phenomenal, it's just all around amazing building, all of the architecture and whatnot. For you guys who like some information, pause it and read it. So that's that one over there. The one yeah, we was just over there. So I'm just gonna go in this room. Wow, look at the bath, Lee. Hang on guys, let's get a, let's get a cinematic. Shops here. Here's the history, guys, of the mansion, of the bathroom, I mean. Yes. So guys, we're now at the Southern Corridor. Just a bit of history and the photo of the mansion. Like I've said, pause and read it. So guys, like I said, we're at the Southern Corridor now. And the ceilings and whatnot, it's just amazing. There's like all history and stuff on the walls guys and this part is obviously the bit that we was just downstairs, the other side we would have been there luck as you can see. And now we're just walking in with Lee. Any idea what this was Lee? I didn't really check. Um, no idea actually. I'm just checking that now. So guys, we were just in the southern corridor, which is here, and here. Um, we're just going up these steps, obviously. 
And Reed is currently in the ladies' toilet. toilet. <laughs> Apparently, that's well. Well, it was back in the day. Yeah. I highly recommend coming to this place, all guys. Is especially if you like, you know, doing stuff like this. Um, we only know about this because two of our friends are lucky enough to live here. Thank you for Cassie and Max for recommending us to come here. Is uh, brilliant, and this, wow. That's why I just wild about guys. This is probably one of the best corridors of the actual place. I thought I said Arbitillery then. Abertillery, I thought it said no Abertillery. Oh, over there, it's just right then, guys. We are now leaving the cool corridor. I yeah. don't know what else to call it. Top corridor, arches and vaults. Managed to get some lovely shots up here. The lighting helps with photographers it does. here, guys. It, does. it gives it a lovely atmosphere. I don't know what I'm doing now with my hand. You can't even see what I'm doing, any. Going down some more stairs, guys. That's all I can say. I can't sound any more informative, to be honest, because I don't know where we're going. Oh, we're by the bat place. Basically, we walked up then. Yeah. So that's well, we've hit. We've done all this part now. Yeah. I'll see you in a bit, guys. When we got some a new place to. So guys, as you could see, me and Lee just had some lovely food. Oh, it was lush. In Woody Mansion. I had a cheese toasty and some crisps and lettuce. And what did you have? Um, I had a chicken and chorizo flatbread. And it was like that big. <laughs> yeah. We're just in the shop now, Today, guys, having a nosy. Woodchester Mansion is regularly open to the public, visiting schools and other groups. I definitely recommend coming, guys. For a nosy. But look, that's the outside. Absolutely stunner of a place. Wow. I'll see you when we're at another part of the mansion, guys. Well, guys, I don't know if you knew me because of the TV, no, but Max has actually telling us about this. He actually found these upstairs in the mansion, and there's just some old, obviously, items. And some old bottles and stuff. Um, I'm just going to buy something now, and yeah, I'll see you in a bit. So we're just having a nosy at the entrance of the Woodchester Mansion. So this is just another view of the stunning Woody Mansion. And uh, yeah, I can't get over how beautiful this mansion is. Basically, we're, well, Woodchester Mansion is somewhere over there. We're just going for a walk. There's lovely scenery around here, guys. I do highly recommend it. I mean, all the money that goes to the mansion goes to doing it up. So it's a brilliant cause, really. And as you've seen from the footage, it's amazing. And if you look, you can just see the mansion. 
in the distance. You, it is by here, here somewhere. Yeah. Guys, me and Lee have just got the iconic ancient ram in. This has been one I wanted to see for so many years. Maybe go something it one day. One day. Not at the minute. We can't afford it. But look at it, guys. It's so old. It doesn't fit the surroundings, to be honest. The area, but it's mental. Look, look at it, Lee. Compared to, look how deep it is compared to the park. See what I'm saying? Mental. Right, guys, I'm just gonna take some photos a sec. So as you can see, we're just closer to the house now. And there's the iconic signs, TV's most haunted film in Ramin. DSLR died, I'm on the GoPro. Um, we're outside the innocent Ramin, obviously. TV's most haunted film in, the Ramin, Derek Akora. What well, could be the main entrance. And uh, yeah, it's been a place I've wanted to see for a while. I hope you can hear me. Hello guys, I'm filming on the GoPro because the Canon battery have died that I'm lending. But me and Lee just uh, come from the ancient, ancient ramen. Ancient ramen, which was surreal to see. We obviously you've seen that we didn't get to see the inside, but seeing the outside is At so the different to TV. Hello, finished. Like you look at it on TV and it looks old, but being here in person and touching it is really. Oh yeah, it definitely lives up to the name. Yeah, and just seeing like all the little artifacts and stuff, and we're big Ghost Adventures fans, so knowing that Zach and Nick Take and exit. Aaron was once there is just amazing. But yeah, thanks for watching this video, guys. Please comment on it, give it the like, and if you're new, subscribe to my channel. Bye, guys.